So guys, for the first step, you want to get to this screen. Now to get to this screen, you want to turn off your computer from the power button and then turn it back on again. Once you turn it back on again, you're going to see the Windows Zone screen. Now once you see the Windows Zone screen, you want to turn off your computer and then turn it back on again. Repeat this three times and then it will bring you to here. It's going to say that your PC did not start correctly, you want to click on Advanced Options, which will then bring us into here. So now once we're in here, we're going to click on Troubleshoot and then click on Advanced Options. Now for the first method, you want to click on Start to Repair. It's going to diagnose your PC, see if this fixes your problem. If that did not fix your problem, you want to click on Advanced Options and then click on Troubleshoot, Advanced Options again. And now you want to click on Uninstall Updates. You can try both of these, so you can try and uninstall the latest quality update, see if that works. If not, you want to uninstall the latest feature update, see if that works for you. If that does not work, then we're going to go back. And now you want to click on System Restore. If you have a restore point, then you want to go back to it. So in my case, I've got a restore point on my system, so I'm going to click on Next. And I'm going to select my restore point, and I click on Next again. And I click on Finish, which will then take you back to the previous restore point. And this should definitely fix your problem. But if you don't have a system restore point, that's fine. We're going to go to the next method. So we're going to close this out. Then you want to click on Troubleshoot, Advanced Options, and then Command Prompt. And now once we're in here, we're going to type in C colon, click on Enter. Now we're going to type in CD space backslash Windows backslash System32 backslash Config, click on Enter. Now we're going to type in MD space backup, click on Enter again. For me, I already have it, so that's why it says this, but in your case, it should work. Now you want to type in copy space star dot star space backup, click on enter. You might not get this, but in case you do, you want to click on A, which means all, and then click on enter. And now you want to type in CD space regback, click on enter. And now you want to type in copy space star dot star space dot dot, click on enter again. And now you want to type in A, and click on enter. Now once you do all this, you just want to close this out, and then click on continue to Windows. And now the problem should be fixed.